Welcome guys! Historically, there have been many bugs in PUBG that ended up being very easy to exploit to get an advantage. However, in the current state of the game, there really aren't that many of them. But those that are there have been there for quite a while and are becoming just a part of the way you play the game. The exploits I'm showing you in this video have also been accepted by PUBG as just a way you play the game, as these exploits are being used professionally. The first one on the list is known as crouch jumping, but in reality it's more like jump crouching. It is the ability to jump out of a window rather than vaulting, which readies your gun sooner than during a vault, but especially also the ability to sit in the frame of a window without jumping out is what makes this so strong. When sitting in a window like this, you can get more information than when you're peeking out of a window from inside the building. However, the main reason this is so powerful is that you'll be able to fire your gun while you sit in the window frame. And thus, you can shoot your enemies from angles they would never expect. The way you perform this is by moving towards the window while jumping at the right timing. Because at the right timing, your character will glitch into the window frame and stand in this weird position. And within this position, you simply crouch and move forward through the window. If you want to do this quickly and super smooth, it's all about practice and timing. Jump and then instantly crouch just as you're hitting that window frame to minimize the time you're stuck in the frame. Easy to learn, but difficult to master. The next exploit is the key foundation to solo drive-bys. When a solo player moves out of the driver's seat in a moving vehicle, vehicles are programmed to automatically break and come to a halt. This makes drive-bys almost impossible as every time you swap seat, the vehicle would immediately come to a rapid stop and you wouldn't get a smooth fast drive-by which is possible by using this exploit. If you hold down the W key in the moment you swap seat, the vehicle will not perform its automatic braking function and so will keep rolling just as you would expect it to without anyone in the driver's seat. This behavior of the vehicle makes so good sense that the problem still hasn't been fixed and so has just become part of the game. But I feel like it would make the most sense if this got fixed and vehicles would simply roll when seat swapped rather than having to perform this bug exploit to do that. This is one of the many things that makes PUBG game mechanics extremely difficult and new player unfriendly. And while on the subject of drive-bys, there is a way to swap weapons without seat swapping first. Let's say you're driving and you have your sniper rifle equipped. Then when performing a drive-by, you would have to swap weapons normally from your sniper to your assault rifle before you can perform a full auto spray down. This extra downtime is caused by the weapon forcing you to wait for the weapon swap animation before you can shoot. However, this animation can be skipped if you simply swap around your weapons in your weapon slots before swapping seats. The next exploit has also been part of the game for a long time now and arguably only adds a very small benefit. When a weapon is equipped with a candid sight, you will be able to zoom in and out faster with a 6, 8 or 15x scope. This is because the candid sight has a bug where it somehow eliminates the scope smoothing of the zoom scroll of the adjustable scopes. There's no doubt that it is an advantage to be able to zoom in and out faster and the candid sight is the trick to do that. Last on the list is the exploitation of viewing angles, namely the right peak. Taking advantage of weaknesses in viewing angles in games happens pretty much in all shooters out there and not just PUBG. But how exactly the perspectives work will often vary between the games. In PUBG, engaging from behind a corner to the right makes your body significantly less exposed than when doing it from the left. This is because of the player camera is placed more to the right than to the left. And so the way good players take advantage of this is by always doing everything they can to make sure they engage in a fight from the right rather than from the left. And that's it. Five exploits that are all just part of how you play the game. Many of these makes the game more difficult to a new player. And if you're a new player, no need to worry because now you saw this video. Thank you for watching the video and I'll see you guys next time.